Destination updated. <laughs> All right, and we are back. Here comes an unprotected right onto a very busy road. Oh, but oop, I can't zoom in on the thing. But by the way, these wheels on the model do move for whatever reason, and the turn signals are animated, which is really cute. Um, but yeah, um, mm -hmm. we're in the intersection. Oh, it saw that person behind, occluded behind the other cars. So that's why it was slowing down, I bet. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Come on, GoPro battery. You can do it. 38%. What's all that? Okay, forced merge. I could have sworn I saw that it was showing there were pedestrians in the middle of the road, but I didn't actually look because I'm looking at the screen through my phone screen so I can make sure it's centered. Everybody's like, Joel, the screen camera is too shaky. I'm like, I know, but there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm trying. I can't put a tripod right there, there's not enough space. And like, the GoPro is my only other wide angle camera, so it's like, well, oh well. Oh yeah, I forgot to check, is it gonna go around that construction? Yeah, it's gonna go around the construction. Looking at the map here. So we're just gonna go through this neighborhood and then straight shot down. Classic. Well, at least we get a stop sign. That's nice. Well, we get plenty of those, honestly, but, yeah. Another screen glitch. Is that roadside assistance? Nope. I don't even know if that's a Dodge Caravan. There's nobody in it, though. Who's behind us? Not a Dodge Caravan. <laughs> That's for sure. I wonder if they've gone undercover. I might have to... I don't know. <laughs> but the, the Dodge, the Dodge Caravans, the white colored and the cream colored ones are the only ones that have parked at the depot that I saw, so... And they had a couple... Oops. They had a, they had a couple of unconverted Chrysler Pacificas, too. I wonder what those are doing there. Maybe they just had too many of them. Use them as work vehicles. Pedestrian recognition never fails to amaze. Even even those folks were sitting down in chairs, partially occluded by a wall. 
still recognized. Absolutely fantastic. Ooh, you, did you see the line? The line flickered. I was trying to decide whether or not that person was about to go out in front of us. Really cool. Out on Dobson for the unprotected left. Score! Ooh, we are going... Okay, it accelerated into that, so I was a little concerned. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Uh, but no, all right. All the power to you. Yeah, cones blocking the lane there, well, sort of a little bit. What we really need right now is an ambulance to suddenly come out of nowhere behind us so I can watch it pull over. That would be really cool. But no, I'm not that lucky. Yeah. Yeah, object permanence on the, with the pedestrian. Occluded by cars. And we just bumped to the right side of the lane a bit there. and smooth 45 miles an hour and never more 45 miles an hour what's that in kilometers uh i'm gonna rough estimate that is about 80 75 maybe circles in my thumbnails or anything. Just take a picture of the car, plop some text on it, and put the Waymo logo on there. I was experimenting a little bit uh, with my the one that I just released this morning. I had um, a picture of the interior of the car from a wide angle. And that video is really popular right now. It's actually the top performing out of the last 10 I published. It's not faster than some of the first videos I published, but it's pretty good. Uh, uh, 21 seconds to go, I think. Actually, no, that may, there's going to be a left turn lane there, so... Oh yeah, hello, JW. There you go. I did try, I did try wiping that a little bit, and it seems to have helped. So thank you. Cycle bin is off the curb. Let's watch the point cloud. Uh, okay, what about the next one? I didn't see it. I'd really like the point cloud to be present at all times on the. Did it show that? I didn't. Yeah, I wish the point cloud was shown all the time instead of fading in and out. I think yeah, that's an aesthetic choice. Or. Probably not aesthetic. They probably researched the heck out of it. Doing it with uh, probably all those focus groups they won't invite me to. <laughs> uh, yeah, well. Wow. Nice 
turn there, dude. Very cool. Oops. Just out of random curiosity, I'm gonna go ahead and check the, uh... Hmm. Is this Circle K on the map? A little bit is. Okay, that is nice. Because a lot of them aren't. Which is annoying. But, yeah. Roadside assistance? No. Okay. Cycling? No, we're uh, oscillating. Yeah, we're kind of oscillating in the lane to, I guess, for cars on the left and right side, and then it will recenter. It's kind of cool. that safety driver he said he watches my videos saw that video I hope he did he didn't leave a comment but I kind of wish he did but I understand if he can't <laughs> I hope I hope he didn't get in trouble for that because that was really that was a really nice gesture saying hi oops um yeah I really appreciate that yeah wow those people a little bit close there. It's the, the close but don't touch policy that I keep referencing. Very nice. I don't know if I have enough space on my phone to keep recording. Man, this screen is glitchy. Let's see if it makes five minutes. Uh, right lane change? Okay. Cool.
No, uh, yeah. All right. I take back what I said. This does never get old. Really. It's just a surreal every time. Well, I guess uh, if they did roll it out today, roll out the new multi-stop feature today, then I guess I missed it. Um, if they're going to, because this will probably this will be my last ride today if I have to go home and make dinner for the family. So, um, might try tomorrow. We'll see what we get. Cause I, I would like to make a video about that, uh, and then I'll have to update the section of my website, the frequently asked questions. Or one of them is, does it take multiple stops? And then now I can say yes. Uh, and then link a video. Which, by the way, yeah, if you haven't seen my website yet, uh, I just launched it. Um, I'll talk in a second. Arriving shortly at your drop-off. Please keep your seatbelt fastened until we reach your drop-off and remember to take all your belongings. Yeah, I just launched it. Uh, it has all my ride data, so data about all the rides I've ever taken in Waymo, including the distance, the duration, the cost, uh, et cetera, et cetera. And then that, that spreadsheet also has some fun statistics about my total miles, total uh, paid to Waymo for all these rides. I've spent over a thousand in rides now, which is fun. Uh, <laughs> and then it has the video list with every timestamp ever on one page, so you can just search through and look for whatever you're looking for. Okay, that was not how I would have taken that lane change, but okay. Um, yeah, like if you want to see all the unprotected lefts in every video, you can just can do a, con a fancy control F and then look for that. And then I think there's like 70 of them now, so you can go check those out. And yeah, go check out my website, jjricks.com. Fun, fun times. <laughs> no ads, no nothing on there, so yeah. We've arrived. Please All right. Your Thanks for watching. Exiting the vehicle. <laughs> and remember to close the doors after you exit. All right, we are back to bad audio. Great. There used to be charging cables right there with the Waymo logo on them. Safety driver told me pe people kept stealing them. It was kind of disappointing, actually. Like, seriously, people? Come on.